Hey everybody, welcome back to Jimmy as Promo. Today we will be unboxing the brand new Galaxy Z Flip 4 along with the silicon cover with ring. Now before we do the unboxing, I do want to talk about all of the deals that you're able to get for all of these devices and accessories right now during this pre-order period, which is through August 25th. Because starting on August 26th, the pre-order deal is done and complete. All of these devices and accessories will be in store that you can walk in and purchase. So first off, when it comes down to the Galaxy Z Fold 4, you're able to get the memory upgrade. So you're able to get the 512 gigabyte for the price of 256. You're also able to get the standing cover with S Pen for free, as well as a up to $1,000 enhanced trade-in. Now for the Galaxy Z Flip 4, you're able to get the memory upgrade on them, which is you're able to get the 256 gig for the price of 128. You can get a select cover for free, and then you can also have up to a $900 enhanced trade-in. Now, if you're only going for the Galaxy Watch 5 or Watch 5 Pro, there is a $125 trade-in credit towards any watch in any condition. And then for the Galaxy Buds 2 Pros, you're able to get a $75 trade-in with any Buds, plus a free wireless charger on them. And then lastly, if you get the Galaxy Z Fold 4 or the Flip 4, and then you bundle in the Watch and the Buds together, you're able to save 30% on these two accessories. So now let's unbox the Galaxy Z Flip 4 along with the silicon cover with ring. Now this one I did go with the Bora Purple with the 256 gigs of internal storage. Again, the same price as the 128. Now this one is for the wife. We did trade in the Galaxy Z Flip 3 for the Galaxy Z Flip 4 to get that really good trade in value. It was 900 off, which means that this device here with this case only set us back a little over $100 with tax. Now as you pop off, the top lid you'll be able to reveal that beautiful Bora Purple Flip 4. Now underneath this lid right here don't forget about this small little package. Inside of here is going to contain your charging cable. So this one will have a type C to type C charging cable on the inside along with that quick little warranty pamphlet guide and also the SIM card popper. Now inside of the bottom package here is going to be the Flip 4 itself. Now on the right hand side you're going to have this little pull tab this little pull tab here is going to reveal the device as well as unpackaging and little satisfaction of pulling everything off. Now, when you take a close look at the device, you will be able to see a slight slim little screen protector on the front. So this way you can have a little extra added protection for your front screen until you feel comfortable enough to peel this off and maybe even replace it. Now for me, I usually take this off. I'm not really stating that you should take it off, but it's one of those things that I normally just take off at the very beginning. But this one is the phone for the wife. She'll be able to have that choice. So a quick rundown of everything that's been improved from the Flip 3 to the Flip 4 is that you will have the improved camera sensor, so the better camera modules on the back. You'll also have a little bit more widgets that you're able to use on the front cover screen, so this way you can do more and have a little bit more functionality when the phone is shut. You'll have a larger battery, so instead of the 3300, you'll have 3700. You'll have the latest operating system, so you'll have the Samsung Win UI 4.1.1 along with Android 12, soon to be Android 13 with that Samsung Win UI 5.0, as well as the upgraded Snapdragon processor. And I do have to say that the hinge is also a little bit more improved, a little bit more reinforced. It feels a little bit better than the Galaxy Flip 3. Now opening up and taking a look at the silicon cover with ring, again there's multiple different versions and styles and colors of the silicon cover with ring along with a few other accessories or cases you can choose if you didn't want the silicon cover. Uh, but this one will give just a little bit of protection, it's going to look good as well as some functionality with that ring that is on the back. So you have a little bit of a wax paper. This one will come off in two pieces and if you wanted to you can attach them together right away which is what we will do before we place it onto the phone. So really there's nothing else inside of this little box. So from here what you're able to do is you have this little slit that's in the middle and then you have this slit right here. All you're going to do is place this on the inside, snap it into place and then now these are held together. What you want to do is take off these little blue slips right here. It is just protecting the adhesive. So those are adhesive pieces. Now once you take those off you can place it on the bottom first. Now once you have it in place it's all lined up on the bottom. The adhesive 
adhesive is right where it should be. Again, you won't be able to see these blue pieces because those are already taken off if you're revealing the adhesive. Now you just want to place it on the top. Now the top just slips on, you put it into place, and then now you're able to open and shut with ease. Uh, again, protecting the device, making it look good, having the functionality of the ring on the back. Uh, so again, this way, if you want to hold it however you would like to, uh, again, protecting the phone a little bit with the little silicon cover, revealing everything. So this way you can still see the front cover. You have your cameras, the cutout for the LED flash, everything like that. The cutout for your power button. Right here is going to be your volume rocker. It is covered again from the silicon. So everything does look good again from the front and from the back. And then as you open and shut, you'll be able to see the hinge you can reveal the hinge of what it looks like on the back and then now it's disappeared you can see it disappeared but because i will not be using this phone as my primary this one is the wife's i am going to see what she thinks about this cover and if we're going to go through to use something else or if she likes having this on the back so i'll let you guys know a little update a little bit later on now one thing i do want to throw in about the silicon case that i do appreciate is that because the bottom is the portion with the adhesive that means at any given point in time if you have to open up the top and access your your SIM card port or the SIM card slot, you are able to. So this way you don't have to reuse or waste all these different adhesives that are a part of the top. And then when you're done, you get back into your device, you're able to slip it on. And then now you're again, you are still protected. So this was the unboxing as well as the application of the silicon cover with ring. Let me know what you guys think. Did you guys pick up the Z Flip 4? Will you guys be planning on picking up the Z Flip 4? What do you think of the cover itself? Let me know in the comment section below. Hopefully you guys appreciated this video. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up. Also, don't forget to hit subscribe. Subscribe on the very bottom left hand side. And if you appreciate this video, then more than likely you'll also like this video. And I'll see you guys later.